Hi everyone. So now I'm gonna go over the our original or um, um, the pudding medium that we learned uh, um, from the course. And uh, in that case, we use um, one untinted uh, base. In this case, uh, mine is Wetco lacquer color dark tint base and i use it only with with only uh just on your varnish uh, so if you have this this is what we learned in the course and uh this is what chile recommends um so i'm gonna go over i'm gonna get just make a small amount of of this put a medium because I already have enough and uh, one tip guys is when I mix when I mix I mix this amount this is another this is the, the, the uh, budget version of the poor medium that will be uh, posted before this and i only make this amount or a little bit more you know maybe four four in four parts from each but the reason being is if you keep your premium poor medium for more than 10 days uh, it becomes thinner and also the color kind of changes now it's pink here uh, because Watco is pink but it doesn't change your colors or your or your uh, uh, pigment or your um, metallics it does not so it uh, dries as uh, yeah as a white let's say if you have a white uh, and I have this spoon, so I'm not gonna. Of course, you have to always, like I said in the uh, other video, you have to always, always uh, mix it. The reason is down here is the thickest part of the of the paint. So if you just go and and mix it well, try to get also like all those thick parts that are needed up you know just mixing everything you know in cooking we do seems right sometimes <laughs> so just mix it and mix the the bottom the sides of the bottom and then just get everything to be homogeneous otherwise if you don't do this the upper part is thin and the lower part is going to be thick so we're going to just part, do a one part okay and so one tablespoon of wet go and one teaspoon oh one tablespoon wet go one teaspoon of josanya varnish and when i make paintings using now what I'm gonna make I'm gonna mention it in the description of course okay so let's say we take one tablespoon All right, so then this is a new one, okay. Maybe also good to mix it. Always mix. 
except for your pillow. <laughs> okay, so now some more. Oh, I don't even have light. Sorry, guys. Oh well, we're almost finished, anyways. All right. Then you just. You know, mix them. I like to clean my tables, my table, spoon and teaspoons and all, and then rinse them with water in a bit. Mix washing them easier. And also I don't uh, get my setting dirty. all right so then you just you know mix them just a minute okay now we're talking and just mix them and mix them now it's a small amount, so you know, it's easy to mix. But when you mix, always mix the sides. Mix the bottom of the container, small container. And right now I'm gonna mix maybe small amounts of three colors. And uh, so I can make a piece and tell you guys, this is the pouring medium. Only with Josonia, this is the pouring medium with no Josonia but the very thin and uh, Minwax polyacrylic and then you know, you get to know for yourself, uh, you get to learn from my mixing and experiments and you know, I guess now you're busy learning the basis of the technique and now we're there to experiment and share with you what we uh, what we get, you know, a lot of uh, a lot of discoveries were made after we took the course, and also the guys before me they did really well. Um, I'm just gonna... Okay, so that's it, guys. Bye for now.